Hello everybody, my name is Hayden, welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario on the Thousand Year Door. In the last episode, we opened, or we found a crank and turned a thingy and opened up a gate, and now we can use our uh, curse that we got in the last episode to turn into a boat and find the ghost that has the treasure. Because we're pirates now. We're basically pirates. But not like pirates is in like, you know, like, mo pi like getting movies and stuff for free, because that's not, that's, 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 that's... That's no good piracy. That's a, it's a crime. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Um, hmm. Where am I? Is there anything back here? No. Cool. I think I have to go all the way around. Um, what's over here? I think I go this way. Yeah, that makes sense to me. Okay, actually, no. Oh, yeah, I do go this way. I just have to dodge the waves. Alright. Oh, come on. That was so close. All the way back to the beginning. This game sucks. I hate it. I don't even know if this is the right way. I do not remember doing this wave minigame thing the last time I played this area. But that has been a few months, so I don't know. This might be the right way. Is this where I find all the toads? Hey, someone's some or Yeah, hey, someone's coming. They are floating on the water. Yeah, there's all the toads. Where am I? Let me see. What? Um guys, I can't breathe. Is that a is that a boat? Hey, over over here! Save us, please. All right, I will save you. I think. If I can turn into a not boat, please. What is that? Well, that was pointless. Oh, you got to be kidding me! I still can't breathe. Hey, bummer. You dare laugh in the face of Mario. Mario will save you. You peasants. Oh, come on. A <laughs> boop. Get on the ship. Come on. It's so slow. It's so slow. Oh, I have to use the, the uh, paper airplane curse as well. That makes sense. I think I have to go to each one separately, or can I just make it to, uh... no, yeah, I have to go down here, and then go back to the airplane thing, and then go all the way around. This game is so dumb. I'm just kidding, I like this game, but sometimes it's pretty freaking stupid, the way it makes you do stuff. Alright, get into this pipe. Get over here, use a hammer. And then all the toads are gonna be like, Oh my god, thank you. And then I'm gonna be like, Oh uh, yeah, wahoo. Hey, we can cross over now. Hey, hey, what are we waiting for? Let's go. I would do a toad voice, but it's like almost 11 at night and don't really want to annoy people with doing a toad voice. <clears throat> oh, it's Frankie and Francesca. From the last last chapter, or it was like the inner inner mission, but like in between. Oh, it was the intermission between the last mission and the last last mission, if that makes sense. Because we had to get the boat pass, and we had to talk to Frankie, or sorry, Francesca's papa, who was like a mob leader or something, like the Godfather, and then he was getting mad because. What the hell? Why? Because Francesca was, like, gonna go run away with Frankie, and Mr. Don Pianta was like, uh-uh-uh, not in my house. 
I don't even know why I'm playing this game. I could just tell you guys the whole plot in great detail. Uh, I don't know how you did it, but you saved us. We came here looking for that pirate treasure, and then, well, our ship got surrounded by ghosts out in the ocean, and we all ended up here. Hey, aren't you Mario? It's me, me, Don Pianta's daughter, Francesca. And Frankie's here, too. After my dad forgave us, we set out on a trip. Uh, the ship we were on got a little too close to this island, and now look at us. Still, I'm amazed the rumors about Cortez were all true, which means he's nearby. How, do you, how are you supposed to say that your ship crashed? Look how clean these people are. Come on. Hey, so by the way, why are you here? Don't tell me Daddy had you come here to take us back. I like how Bill is just, like, floating. What? You're after the pirate's treasure because it might contain a crystal star? Well, I think the treasure is right in there, washed by Cortez's spirit. Yeah, I'm sure you'll be able to take care of him, though. You look tough. Besides, Cortez is, one, is the one that trapped us uh, on that raft, so smack him... Or, sorry, so smack him one for me. I can't read, apparently, so... Alright, um, I think... If I remember correctly... Bobbery can, like, blow up in a hole or something? Alright. How will we ever get back to the surface? It smells so weird down here. I'm... I know at one point there's, like, a hole you go through. Oh, that's after you get Cortez. But, whoa! Oh, uh, whoa, did I surprise you? Yeah, sorry about that. See, I actually followed you in here, but I got lost along the way, and, uh... Well, anyways, I followed this path, and I finally caught up with you, and then... Listen, just forget it, okay? I'm sure the Crystal Star is inside that pirate ship. And the uh, Pirate King Cortez is in there, too. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, probably. No big deal, though, right? You can take him, big guy. We're counting on you. Boy, I know I sure am. And so is Grotus. It's Grotus. Hmm... It's almost like it's Lord Crump, but that can't be. That's just our friendly neighborhood pirate man. <laughs> All right, let's go into Cortez's ship. Ooh, you ignored my warning. Ooh, come inside the door and be lost in darkness. Ooh, come into my. <laughs> <sighs> Enough! I grow tired of the spooky ooh business. I am the, I am a pirate, blast it. Pirates do not moan. I am a cold-blooded villain who robs innocents of lives and loot. Not a crying ghost. And you are after my treasure? And this, this is my ship. What are you doing here? Speak! I'll turn your mustache into a bone polisher, amigo. Oh wait, he's he's supposed to be like a Spanish person. I can't do the accent. <laughs> Good thing that his speech bubbles are over, because that'd been bad. Can't flee this flight. Okay. Well, let's start up with a power bounce, because... Um, actually, shoot, we should have tattled first. I'm an idiot. Ah, oh, darn. Um, we'll do... Let's tattle first. I feel like tattling is a good idea. That's Cortez. He's a dreaded pirate spirit who haunts the island. Max HP is 20, attack is 4, and defense is 1. His HP might seem low, but he's a spirit, so even when his HP hits 0, he'll come back. Plus, he has tons of different attacks. He's as tough and as scary as he looks. I say just keep damaging him, and sooner or later he'll go down for good. Let's give this tormented spirit some eternal rest. I'd say. So, 3, 2, 1... Wow, let me do some math really quick. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... Do we do 9 damage to him? Oh yeah, he's on one health right now. Let's spend this... Ugh. No, I'm just gonna knock him down. Alright. 
right. Um, what did that boo just do? Um, let's swap with Bobbery. And do another power bounce. Alright, knock him down to 12 health. So we can do 8 damage at a time, I think? I, I, I honestly have no clue. Alright, and he does 3 damage, and then... No, I thought we could do 9 damage to him with the power bounce. 3, 2... Or, or I could just do 5, that's cool. Plus 4 attack. Okay, we should probably take him out. Let's switch and just do a normal jump. We do 6 damage with a jump and 9 damage with a power bounce. It's almost not worth it to do a power bounce, to be honest. By the way, we're kicking the crud out of this guy. <laughs> like, I mean, I know he has a couple lives. Oh, come on. Shit. <laughs> you gotta be kidding. That's so dumb. That is so furiously dumb. Alright, we got two of them. Okay, we're all frozen. Except Cortez, that's fucking great. Okay, we're dead. There's no way. We got lucky, okay. We are so c screwed. Um, we do have a life shroom. Let's just use sweet tree. not worth it. Crud, okay. I gotta do some bomb squads, because we have to take these guys out. Yeah, 20 health does seem like a lot when he has all this health from all these swords. <sighs> Alright, Bobbery's toast. Oh, but life stream, dope, okay. But another 3 health. And poisoned, and 2 health. And then this one's gonna be doing two to each. And then Cortez is gonna do four to me. Okay, yeah, we're so screwed. There's no way. Boop, 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 boop. All right, that was all right, not bad. We're just gonna have to keep bomb squatting. And that might do actually a lot of damage, because they're going to blow up right now. After... Okay, shit. Oh, lucky. Okay, we, we really did luck out. Oh, come on. Okay, not bad. We're going to do another sweet treat, and since it's just Mario, it'll help out a lot. Oh, come on. Oh, this is really te You know, if we didn't get that stupid fucking green mushroom shit, we would be fine. This is so dumb. This is actually pretty dumb. Ah, uh, blocked it does, it does three? That's so dumb. Oh, all of them are up again. That's freaking dope. Okay. We're gonna have to do a multi-bounce again. Okay, no, we're fucked. We are actually screwed. We can't get this lucky, it's not gonna happen. Yep, we're screwed. I'm gonna break out of the ice. Yep, okay, wow. Okay, well, how about this? I'm gonna end the episode off here. Um, join me next time when we are going to fight Cortez.
So if you enjoyed this video, consider hitting the like button. Let me know you liked it. Um, subscribe if you want to be notified next time I upload uh, another part of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. And check out my friends, not super gamers, Sky Mini Games. They make great content. They'll be at the end card along with the playlist to watch the entirety of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. And with that, I will see you guys next time. So see ya.